All right, chat, focus. Today, we are speedrunning YouTube.com. Now, we've done this before, where we tried to go from a certain section of YouTube to another section by only using the recommendations. But this time, I am totally taking my hands off the wheel. We are only using YouTube autoplay, and we're going to start with a YouTube video and see where we end up at the thousandth autoplayed video. Where do YouTube recommendations take you if you fully let them take the wheel? That's the game plan. This was, of course, inspired by Sam Bucha, a creator who I like very much, who did this same idea. But there's one major difference. He decided to somewhat arbitrarily start on the number one non-music video trending video at the time that he was recording. And because of that, it was somewhat adjacent to the gaming sphere. And if you watch his video, almost all the videos are gaming related. It's Minecraft, it's Roblox, it's Super Mario Bros. He basically gets stuck in gaming hell, and his conclusion is this. I think the biggest trend that I noticed is that when you leave autoplay going, YouTube not only likes to feed you the same creators multiple times, but the same type of content, which obviously makes sense. But the extent to which they do that, I mean, they really think you enjoy a topic the moment you watch a single video. Like 10% of the videos were Poppy Playtime, 10% were Roblox, 10% were Among Us, 10% were Minecraft. So I think YouTube is heading back in a gaming direction because it's family friendly and it's easy to put out a lot of content in gaming and YouTube values having a lot of content on their channel. So we're setting up the experiment very similarly. I made a brand new YouTube channel. I have zero videos watched on this channel. I have not liked a single video since December 31st, 1969. <laughs> and I even have recommendations for watch history off. So it doesn't download any of the data from any of my other Google sites. Okay. And the main difference we are going to do, the main change we are going to make is that we are going to start with the very first YouTube video ever. Because to me, there's no more neutral way to start this video than with the very first. Where will YouTube bring me from here? It could be gaming, could be IRL, could be sports. We are going full NPC. We're letting Jesus take the wheel and let's see where we end up after 1,000 autoplayed videos. I bet you'll get Mr. Beast after three videos. Okay, chat, how many videos until I get a Mr. Beast video? I would be shocked if we do not get Mr. Beast within single digits. It's Mr. Fucking Beast. All right, so here we are in front of the uh, elephants. And the cool thing about these guys is that, is that they have really, really, really long um, fronts, and that's that's cool. And that's pretty much all there is to say. Dude, <laughs> why are there bookmarks on this video? <laughs> Like, who was like, oh, yeah, wait, I want to go back to the first bookmark about the cool thing. And that's pretty much all there is to say. <laughs> Every year. That's crazy. One video and you bring me right to Mr. Beast, bro. That's video one. Uh, man, dude, he runs this fucking website. It's not even Mr. Beast, too. It's Mr. Beast philanthropy. <laughs> wait, I've never seen this video before. A hundred kids smile for the first time. What the fuck? Does Nolan make a your mom joke? What happened? 99% of people are born like this, with a full ability to breathe through their nasal airway passage. However, the other 1% look like this, with a cleft lip or palate, which makes life terribly difficult for these children as they- Now I feel like a fucking asshole, man. I'm making stupid fucking jokes about how Nolan makes a your mom joke. They're fucking cleft lip. Fuck. So if you don't donate to Operation Smile, you just hate kids. Fuck! Okay, sorry, hold up. I gotta donate to Operation Smile. Fuck. Boom. Operation Smile. Okay, let's get back to it. No. No. We're stuck in Mr. Beast hell! No! Most of us, no! We are at a high. Okay, hold up. We're just gonna watch 1,000 Mr. Beast videos. No. This is a never-ending no. giant mountain of cash. And no, as much cash is, as you can carry- No, this is so bad. This is so bad. Is this why he's the biggest YouTuber in the world? Because if you watch one of his videos, it's all you'll ever watch ever till you die ever forever now? All right, come on. Come on. How many videos to get out of Mr. Beast? Today we are wait, wait, wait! I believe this is our first Mr. Beast gaming video, and I feel like this is gonna get out us, uh, get us out of the Mr. Beast universe. Look at my recommended! Look at my recommended! Look at my recommended! 
Look at my recommended! No way. I think I might be the first person to have this recommendation on a computer instead of an iPad. <laughs> I'm about to ask this 15-year-old a ridiculous question. Like <laughs> that might be the greatest YouTube intro of all time. How did he get away with that? That's crazy. <laughs> Boys, do you know why I brought you? That's my thing. Boys. He took my thing. Boys. I want to say he owes me money, but I technically haven't paid him back for the YouTube video that I uploaded on my channel all of his that earned me a lot of money. So, you know, actually, we're even. We're even. I hope you gamers enjoyed. If you're not already, hit that subscribe button. I'll give one of you uh, a high five. Subs By the way, do you know this? If you if you say subscribe right now to my channel, the subscribe button lights up. Hit that subscribe button. I'll give one of you uh Subscribe, subscribe. Light up the subscribe button if YouTube loves terrorism. No, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> Sorry, just kidding, YouTube. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. It was a joke. Chill, it was a joke. You're so weird. God, it was a joke. Did you light up though? Yippee! Subscribe or I will murder. Yippee! One hundred. Are you fucking kidding me? We're onto the main channel? We've had arcs. We did philanthropy, then we did react, then we did gaming, now we're at main channel. I honestly think this video is gonna be titled Mr. Beast Ruined YouTube. 10% <laughs> of all of my recommendations on a brand new channel, zero videos watched, zero watch history. After clicking the first ever YouTube video made, which could have been recommended from there to anything. Oh man, let's see if we ever get out. I'm in this video! Let's assess the damage over here. I see some water bottles. We're gonna get- <laughs> Okay. So yeah, if you start a brand new YouTube account, you have zero watch history, you click on the first ever YouTube video, and then you go through 134 more YouTube videos, you're gonna get a little bit of Ludwig, okay? Uh, and by the way, uh, we're gonna get thirsty out here. Thirsty out here, you know? I deliver it so well. I remember it like it was yesterday. I deliver it so well. I, I have a big impact on YouTube, you could say. <laughs> So me and the boys are gonna spend 20 The NFL is full of embarrassing oh! moments Like oh! losing a touchdown oh! Oh! Because you trip We did it! We did it! 139 videos later That's what it takes to get out of Mr. Beast purgatory And we've ended up at the 20 most embarrassing moments in the NFL These are the most embarrassing moments in NFL history it, You know what it was actually? Wait, fuck it's probably because I was on the screen and it knows that I'm an athlete and I paused on my own face and the algorithm took that into consideration. They're like, oh, you like athletes. Did you know there's a man too big for the NFL? This is John Cron. He stands at seven feet tall and is so big, he can't stand up on his own, but has the strength of three NFL players. And that's just one. What an arbitrary set. The strength of three NFL players. Which NFL players? Yeah, if it's like fucking Eli Manning, perhaps. These are the NFL players that almost died. What a fucking dark video. Jesus, bring, you know what? Bring me back to Mr. Beast. This is one hour of the funniest sports oh. TikToks. Let's watch. This makes a lot of sense. This makes a lot of sense to go from Mr. Beast to football to Jessa Reacts. It's basically taking the two things that we just did and combining them. Ooh, wait, we have a new one. Hey, yo, where'd Nick at? Back there in the clip. So a cool start to your morning tomorrow as well. Here's what our warm-up looks like hour by hour today. We're slowly gonna we'll hold off those triple digits until about two o'clock today. By three, we're- the first Off rip is like the <clears throat> best intro I've seen of all 161 videos. Okay, now, now we're in the shits. A three hour, 51 minute broadcast of a chase down it's podcast. Kind of you know we like to do hype watch for Cavaliers see. Media Day. Evan Mobley. This is just a fucking actual baseball game. Can you name the guys who were picked ahead of you, Tom? The quarterbacks. This is Check. actually such a good document. Dude, this is crazy. These are actually good videos. What's interesting though is how many videos are getting recommended that are like insanely long. Like all of them are 45 minutes plus. <laughs> Pat McAfee show. It's weird how we got the sports. Man, no, Pat McAfee. Pat McAfee, no! They changed the song! Okay, now we're gonna get this song a lot. I think we're gonna get a moist critical video in the next 100 videos. I'm making that call right now. Ah, boxing time. Chicago had Capone. Whoa, what the hell? How did we go from boxing to mob? Actually, never mind. That is a very easy connection. <laughs> Here's the line. We go from Discovery Channel, History Channel documentaries to... Crash Course, Hank John Green, to Hank Green on the Yard, to Ludwig Man Channel. Watch my line. 
This program explores the mysteries of the Bible. <laughs> oh no. Guys, I think my line might not work anymore. I don't think we're getting to Ludwig. <laughs> now we're stuck in actual purgatory. The ultimate gift YouTube free movies. Wait, now we're just in movies. Okay, here's the line. We go from movies. We get to Hunger Games. We get to Moist Critical, one of the biggest actors in the Hunger Games. We get to Ludwig. Watch my line. Disturbia! I don't know why I said that. Like, I fucking love this movie. I don't. <laughs> there's no way I'm going to get 500 movies. Like, there's no way it's all going to be movies. Okay, we are a third of the way through. Look, nothing will be as bad as the 139 Mr. Beast videos or however many it was. We're, we're, we're definitely going to get, like, a movie review. We're going to get that Dunky video where he reviews an old classic French film. We're going to go from Dunky to Moist Critical. Critical. We're going to go from Moist Critical to Valorant. We're going to go from Valorant to Tarek. We're going to go to Tarek to me. Okay, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing the line. Oh, no. We're at a TV show. Previously. Oh, no. We're at a TV show. What is this TV? Oh, is a TV show called Good Witch? Oh, no. Previously. Oh, no. Previously. Previously, previously on, on Good Witch. Good Witch. Let me guess. Previously on Goodwitch. Previously on Goodwitch? Previously on Goodwitch. Son of a bitch. <sighs> That's 500. Well, here's the thing. We can look at our homepage. Let's open a tab and just look at our homepage. Of course, The Good Wife, my favorite TV show. Lo-Fi Girl, that fucking snake rat for whatever reason. This makes no sense to me based off what I watched. I feel like my homepage hasn't changed even a little bit. Here's the thing. I'm worried that if I keep going, it's going to be actually 1,000 videos in a row of... Just movies. I'm really worried about that. Okay, all right. Let's do a soft reset. We're gonna go to me at the zoo, and that's pretty much all there is to say. What? Three seconds. I'm playing basketball. Hey, the beat go off. Hey. How does that have five million views? What the fuck? All right, we have gotten to uh, meme YouTube. Ow! <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> a cold open into that, a hard cut. Wow, that's funny. <laughs> we react to mean comments. Is this like cut.com or Jubilee? Your booze only make my harder. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> I'm stuck in yeah, mad oh, hell. Really? How does an old boy fart before and after church? I don't want. I don't want to know. I just don't want to know. Wait, I've made a try not to laugh in my life. Okay, here's the line. We're at try not to laugh. We go from try not to laugh to Jimmy here. On the most recent episode of Jimmy here, they had Cypher PK. He plays Fortnite. We go from Cy Cypher P P PK Fortnite to, to Ninja. Okay, follow me. We go from Ninja to Ninja Phil Helmuth card showdown. We go from Ninja Phil Helmuth card showdown playing poker to Ludwig. That's the line. Watch my line. Hello, everyone. This is your Daily Dose of Internet. Daily Dose! What's crazy is none of these videos are Daily Hello, Dose's everyone. videos. Hello, everyone. This is your Daily Dose of They're Internet. all people stealing his videos. Hello, everyone. This is your Daily Dose of Internet. Not one of these have been Daily Dose. Not one. Who the fuck are Bob and Tom? I was just trying to help my buddy. He had just had a couple beers, and he says he wasn't going to blow. I said, you should blow. And uh, he didn't blow when he got out there, so it was going to be a lot of trouble for him. I got out of the car to say, you know, just let him blow. And then they told me to get back in the car, and they had their... Bob and Tom get crazy. These guys seem like a good time. <laughs> oh, Theo Vaughn. I have some tour dates to tell you. If you like hunting and you like capture... Here's what we do. Here's what we do. We're going to get from Theo Vaughn to Theo Vaughn doing a podcast with Jordan Peterson. We're going to go from Jordan Peterson to Jordan Peterson doing a podcast with Ben Shapiro. Follow my logic for a moment. We're going to go from Ben Shapiro to, of course, Tucker Carlson. We're going to go from Tucker Carlson to Nelk Boys. We're going to go from Nelk Boys to Poppin' Zins. And who pops Zins better than me? No one. We're going to go from Nelk to the Yard to Ludwig. Follow my line. Depend my line! My line! My line! Depending on the questions you ask, Putin, the following is a conversation with Elon Musk. It's gone. Something has to happen with Iran. Look, there has to be- Ben Shapiro! In the sense that they have the same starting point- This is point sweaty. This is a sweaty side of YouTube. 
Uh, this is, by the way, so for anyone who's not familiar, this is actually what I usually watch. Like when I'm chilling, like on my couch, like a long day of work, like, you know, I make these funny haha videos. I like to really digest some like Wolfram physics project videos and like, cause I really am interested in like combinators and big facts. <laughs> now, big fact. Yeah. Big fact. That's what I'm talking about. That's, I love big facts. I believe we are now officially two thirds of the way through folks. Two thirds of the way through, and we got to a nerdy side of YouTube. For a second there, we hit Ben Shapiro, Tucker Carlson. I was like, oh shit, we're going to the alt-right pipeline. But nope, we've ended up with physics. Show up as your more healed self. Oh Let my god. Okay, we're on self-help you YouTube. And move. We are on we are on self-help YouTube here. You want to drip dopamine. Is this weird to say? I feel like we've grown up through the course of this autoplay. It started me as a child, Mr. Beast Reacts, then Mr. Beast Gaming. Then Mr. Beast Raw. Then we had some sports phase. Then we hit movies. And then we hit like, you know, various uh, try not to laughs. Try not to fucking cringes. And then we hit uh, uh, podcasts. And now we're trying to manifest our success. We're in our 30s here. We're in our 30s, you know? Maybe, maybe mid-20s. What's next after this? Midlife crisis. <laughs> Ooh, we're in Joe Rogan universe. Uh-oh, this is a bad place to be. On a mission where we're supposed to go through 1,000 autoplay videos, to be on the 1,000th Joe Rogan episode, let me clarify, the 1,000th Joe Rogan episode, he can pretty much just eat up the rest of our autoplay. I think it could be Jover. Literally Jover. <laughs> oh. Oh, we're in news. We're about to hit news. Wait, I wonder if we'll go to MAGA Mail. The new building, paid for by South Korea, was inaugurated in September of 2018 amid hopes for warmer relations. The building didn't even last a year. On June 16th, 2019, North Korea blew it up, broadcasting <laughs> these images to the world. That's so beast. <laughs> I made you a building, and then they blow it up within a year. Holy shit, things are not going well there. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. And she's off. At 105 years old, Julia Hawkins was running for the record books at the Louisiana Senior Olympic Games. She did not run a fucking marathon. No way. She is running 100 meters. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oof. Title threw me off. She's running 100 meters. That makes a lot more sense. Hey, shout out to her. That's so heartwarming. That's so heartwarming. In the beginning. I think we're fucked. Mercury. I think the Ludwig dream is dead. Unless we go from Acts of Apostles to God Gamer Gauntlet. Some would say it's impossible. I would call it improbable. If we get back to movies, I'm gonna be so mad. No, we're gonna get back to movies. No! Okay, I'm at a legal movie side of YouTube. I went from legal movies to like, we're just ripping shit off now. <laughs> it's crazy YouTube recommended brought me to just all this fucking stolen footage. Did Moist Critical ever react to uh, Jerry uh, Springer? This is our only hope. Okay, we could, we could, you know what? I hate to see it. We could get a line here. There's a 20 versus one I show speed video on the right. This isn't crazy to say. Oh man. Okay. All right. I, I think we're totally gone now. I think we're totally gone. What I'm realizing is how much fucking content is on this damn website. Cause these are not low view videos. This has four and a half million views. All right. 100 videos left. We'll see what happens. We'll see where we end up because we have been on a whirlwind adventure. This is a lot different from Sam Bucci's video where he was just in gaming the whole time. I feel like we've, we've gone around the world. We might even have another splash into movies or documentaries before we're done. Look at this fucking beard, dude. What up, David Letterman? We got Matt Rife. <laughs> I was wondering if it was going to happen. Welcome back to Ridiculousness. You know what? This is my fault now. Because if I had respected my good friend Nick's dreams and tried to get on ridiculousness, then there was a universe we got to Ludwig. Just for reference, so you guys understand the uh, institution that is ridiculousness, there are 1,352 episodes, 38 seasons of this show. And that is just for ridiculousness. It does not include amazingness, deliciousness, adorableness, or messiness, which are all other TV shows that are real based off ridiculousness. I think we're going to close this show out in ridiculousness. Give it up for Steve. We're back! Ninja! One of the best Halo players. One of the best what? The Halo player? Halo? Game Halo? Halo? Halo. 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 Yeah. 
Good luck to you, man. Make Thank some you. money. Definitely. I'll tell you, Steve, it did work out. That fucker did make some money. I'll say that, Steve. Yeah. Is this another show? Well, honey, yeah. Uh... We're back on TV. Six hundred ninety views. <laughs> This is just straight up American Dad. Uh, what? That was just the sim. How is this a thing? And now, Dickie Dobbins with the Channel 3 Doppler 12,000. This is crazy. Man, you can watch so much Simpsons. All right, 10 left. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? Did this guy sneak in? Like 10 minutes of him drawing Naruto at the end? All right, final video. And of course it ends. <laughs> Wait. At this video, he just put in, I'm not kidding you, he put in a 15 minute freeze frame of him holding up his drawing. Very nice drawing. We went through a lot. We started with the oldest YouTube video ever made, Me at the Zoo. We instantly went to Mr. Beast, which was 13% of our total run. We were stuck in sports for another 10%. Documentaries for another 5%. Movies for about 25%. We had to actually quit an escape movie dumb by going back to Me at the Zoo. And then we got into Try Not to Laughs, which was a whole hell of a nightmare. Then we got to podcasts. We almost went alt-right, okay? I didn't really, like, touch on it too much, but do you guys notice that? Luckily, we went down the self-help grind until you're a CEO path, okay? Instead of the election is rigged path. It was a, it's a very fine line, to be honest, that you have to draw there. Slip of the pen, could have fucked up, dodged it, nice, way to go. Into wild and out ridiculousness, and then The Simpsons. And this honestly might be one of the funniest YouTube videos I've seen in a while, is two hours of The Simpsons, and then somebody drawing a leopard. <laughs> by the way, by the way, and if you're just tuning in, I did show up, by the way, okay? So if you click through a thousand YouTube videos, I might be there. It just won't be my channel. It'll be Mr. Beast's channel. Still counts. Still counts. Still count it. Count it. Still counts. Have I learned anything? YouTube's really fucking big. There's a lot of goddamn content on this website. That's for sure. Now do a thousand YouTube shorts. That would be interesting. What happened to my favorite website? <laughs> <laughs>